The topic of the 8th Symposium is a strategy and strategy in foreign policy. One of the reasons why we decided to have this kind of a topic is that um, in the turbulent times and in the turbulent conditions of, uh, of the world nowadays, uh, we do not see much of a place for strategy. Europe is in a very reactive mode. Uh, we cannot even speak about tactics, uh, f f not the less so about strategy. And so we decided that it's a good time for us to step back a little bit and to evaluate and to consider whether a strategy in foreign policy makes sense at all. What we are what we're going to do at the symposium this year is we will have two uh, broad uh, topics or two days uh, the first one will be very much concerned about the Czech strategies or the Czech foreign policy. Um, with, within the Visegrad region, uh, we will have several roundtables and several panels that will be devoted to strategic relations, uh, Czech and Polish, uh, Czech and Chinese, Czech and German. And then we will have a uh, wall afternoon devoted to the issue of V4 and Germany. This is an interesting topic because uh, we had this topic two years ago and it was more of an academic debate, uh, really uh, one focused on uh, a handful of people who are concerned about Germany and the Visegrad group. Uh, after the two years, uh, the general uh, context changed a lot and now I think that Germany and Visegrad group is one of the hottest topic of the day, especially with Poland uh, on board. Um, the main speaker of the first day will be Professor Charles Getty, who is a very well-known um, uh, emigre from Hungary uh, who, who fled uh, in 1956. Uh, Professor Getty will be speaking about why the world politics is so troubled lately, uh, which is a very broad topic, but I'm sure that uh, Professor Getty is the one uh, who is the best to address this, this, um, uh, this conundrum. Um, on Thursday, we will have a, uh, a morning session, or actually two panels, which will evaluate uh, the Czech uh, foreign policy under the government led by Bohuslav Sobotka. And then we will have the second highlight uh, of, of the symposium uh, when uh, uh, Mrs. Um, Natalie Tocci, the deputy director of the Italian Institute of, uh, for International Affairs, uh, will join us to speak about the uh, European global strategy. It's uh, no secret that Natalie Tocci was one of the main contributors to the strategy at all. Uh, so we will move slightly from the Czech uh, strategies to the um, uh, European uh, one. And uh, last but not least, there will be a very interesting panel which uh, will uh, tackle the issue of the, of the concept of resilience. Uh, it's another strategic term uh, we know that resilience um, is now becoming more and more, more popular term. It seems to me that uh, resilience is kind of a, uh, a pan, uh, panacea for all troubles that we, that we are facing. Uh, at the same time, we don't really know what uh, exactly the term resilience means. And uh, so I'm very happy that uh, Ambassador Yuzi Shedivi, our ambassador to the NATO, who is a, a great expert on, on uh, resilience, will give the main speech and he will be joined by Jerzy Schneider, by uh, Stefan Fühle, and by uh, Dem, uh, Matthew Rhodes uh, from the uh, uh, Marshall Center of, uh, in, in Garmisch Partenkirchen. So I'm, th there will be two days uh, full of interesting discussions. We are trying a new format, which uh, is uh, based on the breakout sessions. I'm sure that a lot of, uh, of visitors will be very unhappy by the fact that they won't be able to join uh, the, 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 the uh, panels simultaneously, but unfortunately that's life. So I hope to see you soon and um, uh, to have a great discussion.